Hey, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Jones, and for today, I will be talking about an SMG called the Bison. Now, this SMG pretty much is working for me for the past few days. I've been testing it out left and right to see what attachments are correct for this one. And uh, apparently, you know, it does act pretty well the way I have it set up. The uh, the attachment for the barrel, which gives you extra range, it does act pretty well. Even from hip fire, that thing can actually shoot, like from 10 feet away or even further than that. It's it's amazing, you know. So far, this weapon is doing damage, but also something new happens with this one though, is that this is the first SMG that I use without a silencer in a long time. So it's something that's very new, something that's very you know out of my comfort zone because I usually like to be stealthy, you know. I like to keep my my presence unknown most of the time, but uh, now with this bison class that I have, you know, it's, it's strong. It has 64 bullets per mag. So I want to use What I want to abuse is the damage see how much I can like increase the range So should I maximize the range should I add the silencer and uh, It came out towards the end that uh, it doesn't need a silencer if you want to use the full potential of this SMG uh, Use it without a silencer you actually use the extended barrel because that's the way you can be able to increase the damage and uh, I found that out after like like a, a month you know or two because in the first month I know I kind of like disrespected the bison because it wasn't doing damage unless they recently buffed it but as far as I know it's doing the damage is never done before so um, right now I want you guys to like use this and test it out yourselves and see how it is for you and uh, make sure you maximize the range but without the silencer of course without the monolithic suppressor and you should be able to see some little bit of damage here and there because with the suppressor it still acts super freaking weak to me like I don't know it doesn't do the damage it, it acts like uh, like anti accurate like it's so bad with the silencer so I took it off and wanted to test it out myself and it's coming out pretty well right now I'm getting like a little bit of triple kills quadruple kills you know some quads whatever you know it's doing its job and um i want to see more of it so i'll be testing it out in several different maps to see if i can come up with a best class setup for it because it looks like it's a strong weapon it has potential to be one of the top smgs out there so because right now my top smg is the mp5 you guys have seen me play with it you guys have seen me wreck you guys have seen me kills get get kills like back to back and the bison well it's pretty rare to see it at my screen so it's a weapon that i'll be trying out to uh to really like see its full potential see if i can like find a best class setup for it so uh you'll see it like in the, in the next few videos see if i can like come up with the best class setup and i'll let you guys know if uh if everything goes well so uh that's it guys i want to talk about today make sure you enjoy the rest of the gameplay which is the juggernaut of course it's the first time i actually survived with the juggernaut more than freaking five minutes it's insane so uh yeah i never died with the juggernaut this video actually goes for a little bit longer so um enjoy that guys and i know the last time i called in my juggernaut somebody stole it so uh that was a live stream but now i can actually like you know rumble around with the, jug with the juggernaut it's pretty fun as hell so uh that is it guys if you guys want to see more call of Duty gameplay make sure you subscribe for more and i'll see you guys later <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice timing. <laughs> 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 